Uh, hi guys, my name is Peter and welcome to our channel. Today I'm going to talk about GoTech uh, floppy drive emulator. I mean, I got here, well, here's the empty shell, but uh, it's okay. Anyway, uh, in this video I'm not going to tell you how, how wonderful that device, how you have to use it and what it can do. You probably already know if you're watching this video. The thing is, uh, the GoTech, like I said, is pretty good and a lot of computers you just open it and install it. Uh, one thing, if you're dealing with Amiga 500, 600, 1200, and especially you're installing internally, then you have to trim it your housing, or it will be kind of not too convenient to push those buttons, and also read the screen. I mean, it's kind of difficult. Uh, some people take it apart, put it inside, go with larger screen, but in my case, I decided, well, uh, let me see what I can do. And of course, first thing I swap it to internal drive. Pretty much swapping, uh, putting a GoTech to inside the internal drive is straightforward. You just unscrew it, uh, six screws, take it apart, disconnect it, connect it to GoTech, install it, and you're good to go. Which actually turns pretty good. In that case, uh, the screen will face it tor towards you, uh, a couple buttons, or there's a even spot for uh, rotary, uh, rot uh, rotating, uh, rotary style switch. And it's pretty good actually. Uh, it's not my cup of tea. I, I didn't like it. Even I swap it. I run it for a couple of days. I said, no, I have to do something. And you guys already know me probably. If I don't like it, I will modify it. If there's something I'm looking which not exists, I will make it. A few hours later, I come out with that prototype. Uh, pretty much it's kind of simple, straightforward, a little uh, enclosure adapter for GoTech. It's got a 1.3 OLED screen. It sits probably on a 45, 50 degree, probably close to 50 degree angle. Here's a rotary uh, switch, but I mean, whatever it's called, rotary coder wheel. You uh, select it, I mean, pick it file, click it, select it. A USB port for uh, thumb drives, USB flash drive, whatever you can call, I mean, plug it in. On the back, it's opening for uh, floppy drive ribbon cable and power uh, cable. If you open it, right there's a uh, GoTech board. Which, kind of like I said, it, it was pretty simple. So far, I, did, I didn't spend too much time. I just want to see what I can do. I mean, in that case, even better. First of all, you can go with bigger screen. It sits on an angle. Uh, right, right to you. I mean, it's easy to do to read the button. Instead, like on some someone when they uh, model it, put it decoder wheel over here. Then it's kind of turned this way. When it sits vertically, it's it's so simple. I mean, I'm sorry, horizontal. It's so so easy and more convenient to rotate it. And when you find it, the file you you want it, select it, boom, right there. Anyway, guys. Pretty much that's a short video. I just want to share with you guys uh, my first prototype enclosure for GoTech. I hope you guys do like it. If you do, thumbs up. And if you don't want to miss any future videos, subscribe. We will really appreciate it. Thank you.